All right, guys, so this is just gonna be a quick um, leg workout that I did with my friend, Michelle. The uh, gym is being renovated, so all the equipment's moved around. So you're gonna have to just deal with some of the weird angles we have. Uh, we started this one out, actually we did. We started out with the squats and then I decided to start recording. So, eh, you know, I was warmed up by this point, but we did five sets of everything, most of it till failure. Um, which is for me about 20 to 25 reps. We just started out with deadlifts. I was so weak, I'm telling you, I had to drop the weight three times. Um, after that, we jumped into um, Bulgarian lunges. <laughs> These were also super hard. I don't know if it was just uh, the time of day we were working out or what, but I was lacking energy. Um, I was pretty happy with my form, all things considered, because I have pretty weak legs, um, and as Michelle pointed out, I actually do my toes differently. One, I lay my foot flat, and the other one, I keep my toe up. So the next round, I'm gonna try to focus on making sure that I keep my leg flat. Um, and for some reason, my back leg was really killing me on this. Um, but this was a really glute and hamstring focused, so um, yeah, so that's what we did. Uh, then we went straight into line leg curls. Um, man, I just, my hamstrings, they, they came in really nicely for my last prep, but I still just feel really weak in them. So I have been dedicating a full day just to hamstrings. Um, I've not only been doing line leg curls, but I've been doing one legged and that's been helping a lot, but I still have a lot of work to go. Um, and then we had a finisher. This was brutal. It's like donkey kicks, but it's on the Smith machine. And um, if you can keep your foot straight, uh, it works pretty well. My foot did get <laughs> caught a couple of times and I kind of clicked it on the thing. But if you have a partner there to help, this is really good. I tried to go as slow as I could on the way down, um, but I'll see how I clicked it on. <laughs> um, and then when I got to the top, I really tried to just focus on squeezing my glute and just isolating, um, to isolate that muscle. I was really sore after this. So as long as I'm training with a partner, I'm going to be incorporating these into my hamstring glute workout. So um, hope you guys like this workout. Uh, this was something new for me. Um, I'll probably, um, do a, do a much longer glute workout because I do have a full glute day routine. Oh, I forgot we did this. Oh my gosh, this was so awful. This was one of those, and this was stupid. Um, we did sumo squats um, just with an easy bar. Um, man, I forgot we did this, probably because I tried to erase it from my memory. It was so painful. Um, this is nothing. This is like super easy, right? Just sumo squats with the bar. Remember, this is after doing the other um, till failure workouts. So for this one, truly again, I did it till failure. I want to say though, we only did this one three times because I was so um, exhausted. Really isolate when I come up to the top, you drop the bar and then you immediately go into till failure squats um, or pop squats. Holy, holy moly, moly, moly burn. Um, you can see I was, I, I had pretty good form, so I was really happy to see it, All but right, woo, so it was hard. I'm trying to finish up wrapping presents for Adam. I've got a bunch going, oh, that's funny, it matches my TV. Um, anyway, so I'm trying to finish up wrapping presents. I got Adam this new weight wrap. And I am eating my eggs, potatoes, and ketchup. It's really good. I love it. Mm -hmm. Oh, and I'm drinking. My cousin gave me this. So I'm trying it. It's pretty good. It actually tastes really good. Um, it has a little caffeine. Um, oh my God, it's 11 carbs. Ah, crapola. Whoa. All right, I had no idea. That sucks. Okay, hold on, bring that again. Good afternoon. It is Christmas Eve. It's a balmy 75 degrees here in the Fort of Texas. Um, and the in-laws are in town. The girls are out here playing in their secret hideout. If you guys would like a peek, can we take a look at your secret hideout? Marin is 
catching, digging berries. What's Lana doing? Oh, you're decorating your Christmas tree? I am. Wow. This is our big fig tree. It actually does produce figs. It's a ginormous fig tree. And that is our pomegranate tree, which we lost in a freeze, but it's coming back. Um, yeah, so it's beautiful outside. Actually, we should put some shorts on, Lana. I think it's too hot. No, you're not fine. Not it's not hot. When we decorate our tree, we always put ornaments on it. Yeah. Not, but we're. It's here. a little too cold to go swimming. We but should put the heater on it. But go we're swimming. playing hot. We're like putting rocks and berries and let's soccer look, check, balls let's and take a look at it. And ribbons. So what is this? Well, well, it's for the animals. It's for the animals. When they come here, they will set a beautiful bucket nest and their tree will be decorated. Cool. Are you ready to see Santa or see get Santa presents tonight? Yep. For and Christmas? I'm working on Santa with the berries. What are you going to do with all your berries, runny nose? Yeah. you got to rub your nose. I don't have a Kleenex, so let's use that. I got lots of presents today. We are at our Christmas Eve celebration as a family. I got all presents. Marin, come be in our video. And I got Make a Princess by... It's by... Make a Princess. Without the presents. Yeah. Marin got a Minnie Mouse present. Don't say These are all the cousins. All right, we're at Christmas Eve fun. Lana's being crazy. My sister's getting ready for the white elephant. There's my nephew. One of them, two of them. I think two of them are taller than me. Are you taking a video? Yeah. He'll be on my YouTube. Oh, really? Yeah. How much subscribers do you have? Not a lot. Like 35. I need your email. Look, we, t we totally look like sisters. I know that Christmas And the Mackies are here. I'm not playing. My dad's side of the family. What up? I'm taking a video. Oh. <laughs> I'm, I'm cooler than photos. Hi, you know. What number are you? Number five. I'm never here for white elephants, so I didn't bring anything because y'all do them so late, and I always have to leave so early. But this year I don't because I'm not like I'm not going to Houston. It was ugly. It was like Satan. I have no idea what they're talking about. Nobody can figure out what they're talking we had pozole. Looks delicious. I did try it by. It was good. <clears throat> what are we looking at in here? The Charlie Brown Christmas tree from Christmas Past. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, I've never been in here. I was by the toner. I just, the first time I've had wow. seen it. Wow. Uncle Raymond, say hi. I'm taking hi. a video. Okay. <laughs> oh, I've never seen these photos. It was during World War Two, mm -hmm. and in in he was in January was his birthday. Yeah. January twenty eight, twenty seven, and we, when he got to be seventeen, he quit. The baby and I always thought he. And then one of the guys that went to school with him, I I was talking to him, and I said, "Well, you know, Gilbert went in service nineteen forty three. How did he graduate?" And, and go at the same time. He said he didn't graduate. He quit school. Oh, I didn't you know, know that. School. A lot Grandpa? of them did it during, during that time. There, a lot of them quit school. Wow. To go to, to go into service. Lenora, my yeah. mom. Joe, Lenora, Joe's Lenora Joe. and her, her my grandparents. Dad, looks got, like a mafia guy. The padrinos at mm -hmm. the wedding. The godparents yeah. at the wedding. They're friends mafia. of theirs. But that's Len Leonard and Joe. Oh yeah, that's more in the back. And that's, uh, we had this picture of my Esther and, and brother. My mother, he played for the backstock. And they were both working in El Paso for the railroad. And when my daddy came here, 
they sent my uncle to Arizona to play in the Mexican League. He was the founder of the Mexican League in, in, in the Mid I got an article in Sports Illustrated. About wow, it. that's awesome. He signed. And, that's uh, awesome. The, the article says he signed for the So White these Sox. would be Lana's great, 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 great grandparents? Uh, great, great. He would be his great. Because grandpa is mine, and, and so grandpa is her great. So these are your great, great grandparents, Lana. Let's so see a picture of my grandpa. And they had an article, right here. And do you know who this is? No. Hey, my dad. That's Uncle Raymond. See, there he is. How old were you here, Uncle Raymond? How old were you here? Uh, I think I was 20, because I was already been in uh, a couple of years. So he was 20 years old there, honey. And so that's Uncle Ernest, and that's my, that's my grandpa. That's your great grandpa. And then that's Uncle Mar. Come on, Marin. Miles. Come on. Come on. Hold on, I'm coming. Merry Christmas. Mommy, we got a trampoline. Merry, we got a trampoline. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> so for Christmas this year, my brother-in-law bought me a flute. Um, I haven't played since senior year in high school, so that was May 1998. Um, I got it last night and I was really surprised at how much I remembered. So here you go. I'm kind of embarrassed. I've had it for like 12 hours. Okay, ready? See if you can recognize the song. I'm totally going to learn that song and like rock it at parties because who would have thought I could play the flute?